is Patty, Patty Southern Kitchen, and I am getting ready to prepare my 15 pound turkey um, for baking. Okay, these are the tools that I am going to use. Kitchen scissors, and I'm going to cut this uh, net off here. Just like this. I will be baking this turkey on 325 degrees um, Fahrenheit. Uh, it's a 15 pound turkey and I will be baking it for about four and a half hours. The first 30 or 40 minutes I'm going to put it on its, on its uh, breast and bake it up like that and then I'll turn it over and uh, straighten it up. But um, I'm going to cut this, this wrapping off here and just show you the process here. Okay, now this little red um, thermometer here, once that pops up, that will mean that the turkey is done. But I have um, a thermometer here. This is another tool that you will need. And I will stick it in the breast here and make sure that it's about 170 degrees. And then I will test the thighs and they should be about 180 degrees. But this is a meat thermometer for testing. This is a Cajun injector to inject the turkey with the uh, butter that I'm going to use. And I will inject in the, in the breast and in the thighs. And the way I will make my, um, my uh, sauce to put inside the turkey to inject, I'll use uh, a stick of butter and I'll melt that. And I'll put some seasonings. And these are the seasonings over here that I will use. The onion powder, paprika, uh, thyme, garlic powder, and Chef Paul uh, Perdon's uh, poultry seasoning, and uh, Creole seasoning, and I'll use some broth. Then I will strain, once I mix all of that with the butter and the broth, I will strain these uh, ingredients so that I won't get that um, clogged in the Cajun injector. And this is the roasting pan here that I will use uh, to bake the uh, the chick the, the um, turkey in, I'm sorry. And I'll come right back and show you what is going on in Patty's Southern Kitchen. This is the turkey and you can see I have uh, coated it with the different seasonings that I have. I've cut up um, onion, bell pepper, and celery. And I've cut uh, pieces of butter and put in there. And um, I forgot to tell you in this pot over here with the turkey neck over here, come right to this pot, Tyler. Uh, as, you, as you can see here, I have bell pepper, um, green onion and celery in that pot that's boiling for the stock. And you can see here, I have the, um, the butter in the Cajun ingest, injector. I have butter and I put seasonings in and I strain the, um, the seasonings out so it won't clog up the injector. And I'm just going to inject the turkey just like so in the breast part. As you can see here, um, getting the, the breast, injecting, oops. Okay. Putting as much, okay. I'm going to get some more here. I'm going to do the thigh here. 
And over here, oops. So I've got a lot here, y'all. Let's see. I'm gonna come back in in just a minute. Okay, I've got a little bit more here. I'm gonna put in the breast. And a little more here. A little more on the side. And I'm gonna take the juices that have run down and rub them on here like this. <clears throat> Wait just a second. Okay. Didn't go down far enough. Okay. I'll take those pieces and just rub them over the turkey. And what I will do, I am going to turn the turkey over like so and let it cook for about 30 to 40 minutes on this side. And then I'll come back and turn it over and I'm using gloves with everything that I'm doing as far as the basin of the turkey. Okay, I'm going to put her in the oven and I'll be right back. In this pot, this is the turkey neck and I don't use the liver, gizzard, or the heart. I discard that because I just don't use it. But if you want to use that, feel free. If you use it, you can put it in the pot with your uh, turkey neck to boil to make your stock. Now, I've added sage along with these other ingredients that I've told you about, and this is another poultry seasoning that I added. I use the chicken stock and the chicken broth. And I will, um, Go on and start getting the turkey ready, and I'll come right back. Hi, this is Patty back to show you this finished uh, turkey. Uh, I have it in the breast, and it is 177.3, and the little thermometer has popped up there, and here's that finished product of that turkey. Yes, I'll probably let it get browned a little more on the side here, but it is really measuring, okay, reading rather, 177.4 in the breast area. So that's above the 170. And we will come back soon, but this is the finished product of the turkey. And thanks for watching. Thanks for your subscriptions. And we will see you soon. We will be making the dressing tomorrow. This is Thanksgiving Eve 2020.